Lightroom is full of sliders, but some sliders are better than others. So in today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you a slider which I think is by far the best in Lightroom and a slider that I use in almost every single edit. And I'm going to start right now. Now, like I was saying, Lightroom is full of sliders, but some sliders are definitely better than others. And there's one slider that I know just a lot of people ignore, and that's simply because it's not found where all the other sliders are. It's kind of this secret slider, which is incredibly helpful, especially if you use presets. So let's take this photo as an example. It's a photo I haven't actually color graded or edited at all. And usually what I do is head over to my presets over here. I've got my wedding presets, which are found on my website if you are interested. And then we'll just cycle through some of these presets. And actually, for this particular example, I quite like earthy tone wedding, but I'm finding it's a little bit too strong. Well, what can we do in this example? Well, usually you'd go over to the basics panel, fiddle around with sliders and just try and reduce the effect. But now we've actually got an amount slider, which you can increase and decrease the amount that preset has an effect on your photo. So instead of turning off the basics panel, just simply look above the presets and now you can see we've got a preset selected and we've got an amount slider. So for example, if I go ahead and reduce that down, that effect has now disappeared. But if I go ahead and increase it, we can see we can actually increase that effect on the photo. So for example, if you've got a really strong preset, you can actually dial in the exact amount of kind of transparency that preset has on the photo. You can also, which is really nice, increase the amount of effect. So you can go to 100, but you can actually go beyond 100. So for example, if you really wanted to make this effect look strong, you could go to like, for example, 150, where let's say you've got a quite a weak preset and it only works well on maybe contrasty photos. We could choose a photo like this and then go ahead and increase it, which is really nice. So you can decrease and increase the amount of impact that preset has. Now, the biggest problem is it doesn't work with every single preset. Let me explain. Earthy Tone Wedding doesn't have any masks, which means it doesn't have any mask built in. But if I go ahead and select, for example, Dreamy Wedding Film, which is my wedding preset that actually, if we go over to my mask panel, creates two masks, you can see built in, again, available on my website, we can see that particular amount slider has been turned off. And that is because we're using masks. So although this particular preset is amazing, it doesn't work with presets with masks built in. So definitely something to bear in mind. But as you can see, this particular slider is genuinely amazing. And if you use presets, an absolute game changer. If you think it's really good, or if you think there's a better slider, write down in the comments below.